okay welcome back after a long time and from today onwards uh, I will upload regular videos so today uh, in this session we are going to handle about events and notifications in distributed systems so in this topic we are discussing about how events and how notifications are uh, you no know, dealed in distributed systems okay so first let us check what is events what is notifications uh, what is publisher subscriber method and what are the objects in events and notifications like that and all the aspects of events and notifications will be discussed here okay let's go into the topic first it allows multiple objects at different locations to be notified of events taking place at an object so that is a main thing which is explained in events and notification what does it mean that means if an event is taking place in an object or if something happens to that object it will be notified to remote objects at different locations here the thing uh, it looks slightly complicated or complex but it's really simple we can relate this to a YouTube channel example okay so with that in mind we go to the next line the idea behind the use of events is that one object can react to a change occurring in another object so if a thing happens in an object another object okay that may be in remote or in local object can react to that change that is in regarding with the example of a YouTube channel of a pub if a publisher publish a video the subscribers or other uh, people who are viewing the video can react to that so that is what is said here they use the publish subscribe method in which an object that generates events who is a publisher okay publishes the type of events that it will make available for observation by other objects so what does it means so in events and notifications in distributed systems it uses a publish subscribe method similar thing that is we used in YouTube channel right so the here the publisher or the object that generates the events is called publisher okay that publisher publishes the events okay and make it available for observation by other objects so similar in the context of a YouTube channel the publisher or the someone who is creating the videos will publish or creates the videos so he, uh, videos means here it is events okay and it will be given to the public for observation or for further observation okay that is said here so next going into next line objects that want to receive notifications from an object will subscribe to that object which publishes the event so objects who want uh, or who want to receive notifications from a publisher or from an object okay will subscribe to that object okay which object which publishes the event or the publisher so the objects who want to receive notifications from a publisher will subscribe to the publisher okay when a publisher publishes an event subscribers that expressed an interest in that publisher will receive the notifications right so publisher publishes the events and when the publisher publishes the events uh, the subscribers receive notifications and the subscribers will get notifications only when the subscribers expressed in the in, in a publisher okay that is said here subscribing to a particular type of event is called as registering interest so registering interest is nothing but it is a process of subscribing to a particular type of event or subscribing to a particular type of publisher is also called as registering interest so these are the basic things uh, in events and notifications so the next 
main thing the two characteristics of distributed event based systems are it is heterogeneous and it is asynchronous so these are the main two characteristics of an event based systems okay so publish subscribe paradigm okay that we have already discussed uh, that is the publisher publishes events and subscribers uh, receives notifications by expressing the interest on the publisher right publishers send notifications that is object representing events okay with regard to youtube example uh, the youtube creator will create the events and send notifications okay the notifications contain the objects that are representing the events then subscribers registers even interest to receive the notifications okay so next subheading in events and notifications in distributed system is that the main participants in distributed event notifications it is very simple there are mainly uh, five to six participants that is first one is object of interest or publisher second one is events third one is notification fourth one is subscriber fifth is publisher and sixth one is observer objects okay first one object of interest or publisher object this is an object that experiences change of state as a result of its operations being invoked its change of state might be of interest to other objects so simply we can say that objects where events happen that is called as object of interest okay simply this is also known as publisher okay so second one is events it occurs in the object of interest or events were created by the publisher or it or it or events occurs in the publisher right so in the case of a youtube channel events is nothing but it's a creation of videos or the uploading of videos third one is notification an object containing information about an event it contains a type of event and its attributes so uh, with regard to the example of YouTube notification is nothing but it is a messy information of a video that is uploaded or the message that is uh, obtained to the subscriber when the publisher creates an event or creates a video fourth one is subscriber subscriber is nothing but an object that has subscribed to events in another object or which registers interest and receive notifications then the last two one is a publisher who generates notifications usually an object of interest and observer objects are decouple an object of interest from its subscribers so observer objects are nothing but it is used to decouple an object of interest from its subscribers that is uh, with regard to an example of youtube channel it is mainly used to unsubscribe a publisher okay so these are all about of uh, regarding events and notifications in distributed systems a very simple uh, topic in distributed systems uh, everyone saying distributed systems is a very dry and very tough subject uh, but it's very really simple I will upload uh, you know your videos regarding distributed systems or uh, difficult topics in dis distributed systems daily so if you like this video uh, please like the video and support us by subscribing and please share your commands uh, and comments um, do you know stay in tune god bless you all may god bless you all thank you thank you for watching